Hi, I'm Barry Sahajian. Today we're talking about the fat back beat. And what is the fat back beat? It was a style that kind of started with James Brown in the 60s and 70s. I don't care. Fat back refers to the fourth beat. One and two and three and four. And there's your fat back. And what happens is some of the notes are displaced in the rhythm, makes it more syncopated. And I'm going to show you that today, how to play it and how to understand it a little bit. And I have some examples. So let's get started right now. This is example two. I'm adding a little more rhythm to it to make a little more of a fat back feel. And it sounds a little like this. I'll play it with drums and keys after this at a little better tempo. So you hear that da 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 That would be defining the fat back feel in this line. This is number three and I made a variation slightly on that line and I put in a, a flat five which made it sound a little jazzy. It's basically the same line. Check it out and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So the line goes like this. And what you're hearing, that blues or jazzy note, is a flat five, right here, in A. So on clip number four, I did something a little different there. I used an A7 arpeggio exclusively, and I threw in a slide. And when I slid up, I had to go out of position and then go back in. I'll explain. Add a little articulation, what a difference it makes. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and got something out of it. Please subscribe, hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. I'd like to remind you that I am teaching virtually online and teaching is one of the fastest ways you can learn when you have a teacher observing what you're doing, what you need. I can help you out. I'll put a link to my website for further information. And until next time, keep playing bass.